Greetings, adventurers. This is Chris with New Adventures in Skyrim. Today we are back with Fizban. Um, before we launch in and go in character, a couple things. It's going to be a little bit of a different episode of sorts. I am planning on doing a quest while we're here. And then just walking around... I almost said walking a wound. Walking around White Run. <laughs> um, talking to people, seeing what's up before we take our carriage ride back to Winterhold to set up there for a bit. Um, last episode I <laughs> died because I was tired. And so with that said, when he dies again, that that will be it. So I want to get him armored up. He's going to start doing that at White Run. Um, additionally, I was rambling on about something else. Um, and I don't recall. Must not have been that important. Ooh, the voices are all, and the people are all distracting me. I'm sorry. Oh, that was it. Um, I'm also still tired because I had a vivid dream last night. Not a nightmare per se, but not, I didn't get a lot of sleep, so I'm tired now. So I don't want to go out and die in combat again. So with that said, um, we're going to launch into that. I'm going to hop in character. And if I forget, hello, Bree, excuse me. Um, take care of yourself, take care of the ones around you, the ones you love, and without further ado, we are going to hop in character. Bree. So, <laughs> well, first and foremost, I'm glad we remembered I actually have a home here. I don't need to sleep in, a, in an inn, but you were out last night. She heard about, in fact, I'm going to have you hang out here for a bit. I've got your back. I know, I need you to wait here, though. As you wish. Just don't forget about me. Oh, if I do, I'll pass right by you on the way out. Just joking, I wouldn't. Anyway, so there was a priest here looking for help, and I, I think I can use Jazargo's scrolls he asked me to use. <clears throat> oh, good, busy morning. I don't know where the priest is, where the uh, uh, temple is, so I'm going to try to look for that. In fact, I'm just going to kind of walk. I'm super, super familiar with this. There, there's a cow. Get my feet wet a little bit. <clears throat> Sticks better to the concrete. This is the, uh, oh, the gray main home. That may be it. Or no, that's okay. Up to... You better give me five septums right now or I'm going to bloody your nose. No, please. I really don't have any money, Brave. I'll give you ten septums tomorrow. Just don't hit me. Ten septums tomorrow, baby Battleborn. Or I'm going to bloody your nose and your lip. What are you looking at? I'm not afraid of you, you know, even if you are my elder. You shouldn't be scared of me because I'm your elders because you'll catch an ice bolt to the face. Good luck, kiddo. Ooh, this may be it. Or maybe that's it. Had something to do with undead. Probably down here. What have we got? Let's see. The priest of something. I thought she said RK, but I don't know. She was into her cups last night. I don't even know if she knows. Let's see. Oh, I think I saw. Okay, but can I read? And it, oh, it is stealing. Glad I read that. Get some sheer gore. Come back and read this again, or maybe try to find my own copy. I want to create a spell that just copies books. Alright. <laughs> no, I'm good. 
Sir, are you the priest that is in need of help? Tell me, do you believe in mighty R.K., god of life and death? Well, tell me what you think about him. I heard the name, I guess you could say. Well, as I said, R.K. is the god of life and death. You'll find his temples and halls of the dead all across Tamriel. <clears throat> Priests of R.K., such as myself, perform rites for the dead and sometimes console the bereaved. We also keep a constant vigil against those who practice the vile arts of necromancy. I asked the question because I was hoping you might be able to help me recover something I've lost. Ah, uh, okay, yeah, I think, um... I reheard you, or you talked to her last night, but what's the deal? What do you need help with? My amulet of R.K. It's the source of my divine powers and also a sacred badge of office. And I'm probably embarrassing you I lost it. I misplaced it in the catacombs. I'd look for it, but I have been hearing noises down there. I fear the dead have become restless. Hmm. Without that amulet, I'm powerless to confront them. Would you be willing to search for it? Absolutely. I'll just wait here and make sure nothing foul escapes the catacombs. The blessing of R.K. be upon you. Thanks, mate. Do I have those scrolls now? All right. that out of the way. Whoa. Um. Goodness. This is not working like it's supposed to. With that said, between you and I, what Breeze said. Is that I need to pay more attention. I'm sorry. <clears throat> Let me get this story out before I go blow myself up. Um, <laughs> what Bree was saying is that. Won't do that. That. And, uh. They were drunk down here and lost his amulet. <laughs> so, I'm not going to guilt the guy. We've all had our moments. Let's see. I had something else, but I'm wrong. I hope I can do this. Because that's a lot of damage. Where are you? There we go. All right. This is going to be tough. I don't know how fast those work. supposed to be doing exactly. Oops. I'm going to take a moment over here.
Whoa. Those fools are actually fighting. <laughs> What am I supposed to do with his? Oh, okay, I guess I did it. <laughs> By the skin of my teeth, but... Whew. Now... What I can... <laughs> I spend so much time among the dead, I sometimes forget how much I missed the company of the living. I understand that more than you know. Now, with that out of the way, I can go and do this my way. Well, assuming they're not all waiting right here for me. It's a lot easier this way. When I'm not blowing myself up. I gotta talk to him about that. One could take that as a honest mistake, and I'm going to. But I'm still gonna give him heck about it, you know? Sorry, I kind of made a mess, almost blowing myself up down here. I think we're about done. Oops, did I just steal a goblet? I have a remedy. Welcome. I think that's all. Okay. <clears throat> I'm gonna go yell at Bree for almost getting me killed, and then go yell at Chizargo for almost getting me killed. Did I actually get? The amulet? I didn't see that. <laughs> I guess not. I'm glad I took a moment. Okay. Man, there's dead being risen, goblets everywhere. What kind of drinking and partying were they doing here last night? That leads to this. Goodness gracious. All right. Anders, sir. And I spend so much time among the dead, I sometimes forget how much I miss the company of the living. Yeah, I heard you mention that, but I got some great news for you. Bam. Oh, thank R.K. Please, take this gold for your troubles. There you go, mate. May the blessing of R.K. be upon you. <laughs> be more careful when you're in your cups. Let's go grab Bree. Do a little walk around here. Good evening, guard. What do you need, my friend? Well, Bree. Desargo almost got me killed, and you, by way, by kind of association, almost got me killed, so thanks for that. And, uh, uh-oh, what is this guy running? I'll be right back, Bree. I like to play this game. And I'm going to start getting light armor because I'm getting beat up in these robes too much. I'll be right back. Excuse me.
when I get this message, we're gonna go to the stables and go to White to Winterhold. <clears throat> that is pretty funny, chicken. All right. So are you almost ready? We don't have anything else to do here. Should I stop? All right. Let's see what he has to say. Let him do his job. I've been looking for you. I noticed. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. What have we got? Let's see here. There's a new museum opening up in Dawnstar. The huh. owner is asking me to hand out invitations to travelers. Oh man. Looks a like museum. That's it. Got to go. Well, thank you, mate. At least something good came out of that trip to Sarthal. I didn't find anything but dust. Well, uh, and me, but uh, let's get going. Of course. Let's go. What do you think? Let's go check out, um... We haven't actually... Yeah, we'll run there. Let's go check out Dragon's Reach. Walk around inside for about ten minutes, then we'll head out on our way. Alright. The cow definitely agrees. I wanted to talk to... Oh, she's not here. Was that priestess? Is that her? Danica, I believe. I don't know. He's the Talos Screamer. Excuse me. Let's go meet some of the people in White Run. Look around a little bit. Sometimes. Um, okay. I forget. Well, did you slip up again last night for a drink of the banner's mare? Heard about that, did you? Yes, I went out for a pint or two. What of it? These secret visits to the tavern will make you an easy target for an enemy assassin. You should have told me first. Damn it, woman, I'm the Jarl of Whiterun. I won't apologize for talking to my people. Can't protect me every moment of the day. That might be so, but it will never stop me from crying. I like that. Um, who do we want to have a talk with? You know what? Let's go look around first. Well, that's the where the wizard is, obviously. Ooh, did I have anything actually too? Bust apart while I'm here. Yes. I'm gonna have to come and enchant a full set of light armor. Bree. Well, not come back here, but we will have to do that at the ch at the uh, college. I had some parts pulled aside. Maybe I can do some stuff for you too. So let's see what we have up here. All right. So hey Andy kids. can hardly stand it. Another wanderer. Father Here's what my father me a new dress day job. Now where is it? It takes a while to make a dress, Dagny. You have to be patient. But I don't want to be patient. I want my dress right now. Father promised. Great point. All you ever do is complain about what you want. You're a spoiled baby. I'm going to tell father you said that. So tan your hive for sure. <laughs> Yeah, it is high. Oh, what is this? Oh, that's kind of cool. I think that's the same map that's on the wall, but... Oh, okay. Let's go see. The Great Porch. <laughs> Couple more minutes free and we'll take off. Someone just draw their weapon on me? Oh, okay. It's big. I don't see what's great about it. Oh, what's okay? Maybe that. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> that was interesting. I'm gonna check my map and see what that is out there. I don't even know. Just mountains. <laughs> Probably up around there. I 
That was really neat, actually. Kind of scary in a time like this. No wonder they're not eating out here. <laughs> the dragon can just swoop in. But that view. Gosh. What are those mountains where I saw that castle? They're gonna say it's great. Do do more with it. You have all that open space. Okay. Oh man. The dragon was over there. Alright, Bree. <laughs> let's go talk with the Jarl. Well, actually, it's his brother, isn't it? All this standing around is rubbish. We should be taking the fight to the Stormcloaks. Yeah. Maybe we'll meet in the field. Just pray we're on the same side. I guess. You are May the gods game. watch over your battles, friend. Nothing else. Now, if you don't mind, I've got a city to keep. All right. Just trying to see if there's anyone that'll have an interesting new conversation. I've got my eyes on you. I understand. It's your job. For you, Ferengar. Divine smile on you, friend. Yeah? What do you know about shouts? Well, I only know what I've heard in the old tales. Shouting is an ancient form of magic. The use of one's voice to project their power. Hmm. If you can shout, you need to go see the Greybeards. They'll know what to do. I really don't want to see them. What does that mean to be a dragon? I boy? don't know much. Only the old tales about the ancient heroes who would use the voice to defeat the enemies of Skyrim. They say the emperors used to be dragonborn, but that all ended when Martin died during the Oblivion Crisis. Hmm. The Greybeards can tell you much more than I can. They're the masters of the way of the voice, and taught Tiber Septim himself. Oh, I don't hold him or them in such reverence. Remember, your mind is the best weapon you have. He always says he doesn't know much, and then knows a lot. I'm gonna mute this, and I have a itch on my head. You wanted to go through all this, Bree? Well, let's go see what's in here then, okay. Hmm. Does this go up right here? Yep. Okay, this is where steward sleeps. I just remember I had to find him that one day for all my money. Well, alright, Bree. Okay. Let's see this here. Nice way to let the sunlight in. Alright. Well, Bree. Bye. <laughs> so we're gonna go and get our carriage oh man sort of oh, I thought it was raining on me um 
and go to Winterhold. Well, there he is, Screamer. There you are. It's a shame, isn't it? Someone was saying something at the tavern the other night. You needed help or something. The Gilderdream, yes. It's a bit of an eyesore at the moment. More of a problem for the pilgrims than for me. But not yeah, many of them gross. around anymore. Why? Well, like, what's their issue? A big dead tree isn't very inspiring if you're mm. coming to worship the divine of wind and rains. <laughs> well, Kinareth fair takes enough. life, and we need a living tree to be her symbol. Well, what do you need? I've thought about that. Trees like this never really die. They only slumber. Hmm. I think if we had some of the sap from the parent tree, we could wake up its child. But you tried shocking you it? Get to the elderly, you couldn't tap it. Not with any normal metal. What was it called again? The what tree? If you want to help, you'll need something to cut into it first. Hmm. You'll have to deal with the hag ravens. <laughs> I've heard about the weapon they've made for sacrificing Spriggans. Spriggans? It's called Nettlebane. <laughs> the hags terrify me, or I would have gone after it myself. This is gonna be fun. I will get that for your you. Your spirit is strong. Kinareth's winds will guide your path. Mm. It's held in a Hagraven nest called Orphan Rock. Hagraven. I wanna do some research into them. Well, it'll be a while. I need to go study and armor up, but let's go do this. Let's take a little leisurely stroll through here. Excuse me. I gotta start thinking if I'm gonna start spending more time here or at the college or traveling or just if this house is worth, I guess, putting money into. It's got a bed and a chest and that's what I need. Lydia's there. Maybe we'll take her out after this. We'll get her out for a bit. I guess, where are you at, Bree? Nope, sorry, nothing. I guess I could just take both. No, Bree. Take it easy, guard. Sometimes it's nice to just slow down and take a walk through Skyrim. They do have one, I'm going to break character for a moment, a mod I want to look into in regards to things like this. It's a carriage service, so you could take a Instead of just fast traveling, take actual, get it on the wagon and tour. I think that I may look into doing that instead of fast traveling. I hate that. I don't like skipping the game. I want to see all that stuff. Where is Bree? Well, I'll worry about it in a minute. Did she get arrested? Did grab her, right? Yep. All right. We'll go to our quarters when we get there, settle in, and say goodbye. You can actually see the barrows up there. That's kind of neat. They look like ribs. In fact, that's that castle right up there.
Oh, is that where they keep talking about those dudes, the gray beards? Uh, well, maybe I won't go check it out. <laughs> I do need to be mindful. I just saw a dragon. <laughs> I thought he was on his roof. Still no brain. I'm not paying for her ride. She can worry about that herself. That's him over there. be in a little more of a hurry when we get to the winter hold because it's cold. I'm gonna be running. I can take you to any of the hold capitals. Awesome. I'd like to do that, please. Where do you want to go? How's about winter hold, please? I know you're not happy about that. Climbing back and we'll be off. Alrighty. Wonder how long it'll be before we come back here. I can't wait here forever. I know. Get up there. Let's do this. Maybe get a covered wagon next time. Just almost. Have you been drinking again? You almost ran face first into that. Goodness. You need to slow. You're going to spend some more time here at the college, as a matter of fact. Alright, let's go. You know, I may Dr. spend. Thinking. Maybe I'm the dragon boy, and I just don't know it yet. Could very well be. Um. They come down here sometimes, spend some time with the people. Yeah, maybe. You know what? That'd be very interesting. Maybe we could, um. You hear a lot about the conflict and the issues they have with one another. Well, let's see. We can do something about that. Let's go get in. I'm cold. Ooh, let me in. Hold your breath. If you ever need some, huh? I think the college is due for a change in leadership. Oh, here we are. Well, I'm actually gonna. I got my new soul gem back. All right, we're gonna end this adventure here. Oh, hi, Bree. Thank you, appreciate that. And um, we will regroup, recollect, and see where we will go from here. At the moment, I have no idea where, but I know there's a myriad of different directions to go and all of them can be equally as fun and engaging. We'll sit down armor up, see how we feel. Maybe we'll take some um, milk, what do they call a milk drinker mission. Go out there, test ourselves, get used to it. It's going to be very odd, I believe, casting in armor. But we'll see. Something we can do. Without 
Anything else to say? We are going to end it here. But um, until the next adventure, I hope you have fun. Take care of yourself and the ones you love. This has been Chris with New Adventures in Skyrim, and uh, aka Nas. And we'll see you on the next one. <laughs>